Oh, most definitely. Most, most definitely, you know, Coach. If we ain't on that, you know, oh, no, this is my team, all that stuff, man. We GTM. We, we, we brothers all the way from 6U all the way to 14U. And, you know, that's just what it is. We're going to argue. We're going to do that just like regular teams, you know, in competitive mode. But at the end of the day, we brothers. We're going to help each other be successful. And that's what I love about this program, man. That's what I, I truly love about this program. We truly are a family from the kids to the parents to the coaches to the fans. You know what I'm saying? Even you. Now you family. You know I appreciate I'm it, man. I, I appreciate it, man. You know what I'm <laughs> For sure. <laughs> For sure. Yeah. For sure. For everybody that shows us love, man, we try to show them love, too. So... And that's just what it is. Everybody that come to preseason in the swamp and all that stuff, we always, you know, show love back to them. And we become family, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Same thing with your show, you know what I'm saying? I got to do what I need to do to make this pretty, pretty big, you know what I mean? I appreciate because it, man. Today is family, you know what I'm saying? So that's what it's about, Coach. Yeah, man. I, that's why I love that GTM organization, man. Greater than me. Is 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 deeper than just football over here, man. Wins and losses, it is what it is, you know what I'm yeah. saying? But at the end of the day, we got each other back, and we with these kids all the way through, you know? Uh, we ain't yes, never yes, sir. Stop. Yes, sir. <laughs> yes, sir. Yes, sir, man. You know, for me, Coach, I really do, you know, appreciate it because whenever, you know, I catch wind of people that I know are doing it the right way, man, and really are, you know, making good deposits into these kids' lives, I want to do everything I can to promote that. You know, we all, listen, just like you said, GTM, you guys all are, are, are one family. I look at the whole state of Florida, the youth football community is all my family. You know what I mean? And, uh, you know, we got enough negativity going on. And I try to just, you know, everything I do, try to make coast to coast to my show and the things that I bring to it. I just try to bring a positive light, you know, to, to the oh, yeah. impact that you sure. guys are doing, you know, around the state of Florida, man. You know, we got... We got the best football in the world, man, hands down. I think that, you know, I think that, you know, we just need to make sure that we're continuing to promote our sport and to promote our kids in a positive light. And I think we'll be all right if we all work together and do that, man. Most definitely, bro. Most definitely. Yeah. It's Florida over everybody. Florida over everybody, man. Florida (laughs) over everybody. And we'll eat, man. Listen, so just just a couple more questions, man. You know, one thing, and, and you touched on a little bit, that I've always been impressed with, because I caught wind of GTM about four or five years ago. And one thing I've always been impressed by is the fact that you guys are good from top to bottom. You know, and so, you know, what do you think that you guys are doing over there that you're able to compete at such a high level on all your age groups? Man, first and foremost, like I said, you know, the product speak for itself, you know. Mm-hmm. Like we have a lot of kids, you know, uh, when we first started out, that was kids that a lot of other programs, quote unquote, didn't didn't see as superstars, didn't okay. see as didn't see as that. So you know, we just develop what we what we got, you know okay. what I mean. And then at the end of the day, you know, of course. A lot of those kids that was quote unquote superstars, you know, we started getting, you okay. know, and you know, we just keep developing them, you know. And what yeah. I like right now at six, you we young, mm-hmm. we probably got 12, 15, five year olds on the team, you know what okay. I'm saying? Okay. But we gonna develop them kids, and we gonna do what do we do? Like a lot of our six year olds, they first year players. You know what I mean? But we still bumping with anything around. I'm telling you that for sure, for sure. You know what I mean? Nice. So, you no, know, and like I said, our coaches dedicate themselves, man. They put so much time and effort and money and resources and everything into these kids where we we have no – we have nothing else but to be successful. You know what I'm saying? For sure, like, for sure. We put so much time and effort – for free into yeah. these kids, man. You know what I'm saying? Like it's it's always it's always football. It ain't never no. You know, on off season we grind together, we team bond, we do all of these things to make sure that these kids stuck together. Nice. And then when we get to the football season, you know, everybody get to see the chemistry, man. And you know. It's, it's, it's all love all across the board. But, you know, 6U, 
all the way through 14U, man, we we challenge our coaches as well, too, to be the best. Like, I rank, we rank our own teams. Like, we have our own coaching group, and we okay. rank our own teams. So it's competitive inside our own organization. You know what I'm yeah, yeah, so, most definitely, most definitely. Yeah, that's just what we do, man, just to – you know, stay on top. I can't give all these dudes everything. No, no, nah, nah, you can't give them everything. You know, but you you can point them in the right direction. Everything we do, you know what I'm saying? So <laughs> I can't give them everything. No more, no more free games. They gonna have to start paying us. They gonna have to start paying us for this, man. <laughs> hey, hey, well, hey, listen. So would I give them? Would I give them too much? Um, you know, how are you guys able to continue to get top talent into your program? Because, you know, you do, you know, have the Gainesville Elite Gators, you know, that are right there in town. You know, um, you know, you got, you know, you know, Ocala that's, you know, not too far away from you guys. So, but kids and their parents are choosing to come to GTM. And, you know, and, and why do you think that is? And what do you think you guys are doing that make that a, a great landing spot, you know, for these kids, you know, that want to compete and want to play at a high level? It's a family. It's nice. a family. And at the same time, we good from top to bottom. Yeah, yeah. You understand? What everything, saying? everything you, good. You don't, want, you don't want your son on 12 you. You know, you 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 bring your son to be on 12 you, then you got a kid on 7 you. And the 7 you team horrible. Got gotcha. you. You know what I'm saying? Got gotcha, gotcha. you. don't want that. You 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 want to be able to bring your kid, your nephew, your little cousin, everybody on one organization, and when y'all come to the game, everybody good. You enjoy yeah. every game. You know, you're not yeah. going back home in a little brother, man. Y'all sorry, man. <laughs> oh, you got to hear that all the time. You know, no, man, from top, from the bottom all the way to the top, GTM is the best. You know what I mean? Okay. So they bringing their kids and they doing these things. You know, and that's that's just number one. That's how they get sucked into it. You know what I'm saying? Like I that's said, right. at the end of the day, that's only right. That's what a parent should do. Nobody wants to sit at it. I got to wait all the way to 12 you to see some good football? No, man, no. I want to, when I get to that game at 9 o'clock in the morning, I want to see good football all the way to my kid play. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So of that's course. one of the of reasons, course. like I said, we get in you know, multiple kids because, like I say, you know, that's what it is. And then on top of, you know, number two is the kids love us. The, it, it's adults out there that, you know, might be hating on what we're doing and all that stuff right now, but the kids love us. Okay. You know, it, at the end of the day, if they sit down and talk to their kid at other programs right now, they kid will be like, yeah, I really want to play for GTM, but my daddy don't like them. <laughs> my daddy don't like them. I really want to play for GTM, hey. but my daddy don't like them. Hey, boy, uh, e, you, e, you get into a raw tonight, boy. <laughs> yeah, I'm telling you. So, you know, it is what it is, man. Like I said, you know, the kids love us. They love us. They love to have fun. We have fun. That's what we do. Okay. You know what I'm saying? We no. have fun. I ain't. If you see me outside of football, I'm not. I'm just a chill dude. You know what I'm saying? Man. But I do this for the kids, man. And the last time we did this show, I'm talking about all the kids. Man, I see you on YouTube. <laughs> I see you on YouTube. Nah. Woo, 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 woo. You know, and so I like, okay, let me do something special for them this time on YouTube. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, Let's yeah, get for sure, real. For sure. Coach E out there, you know what I'm saying? But at the end of the day, like I said, this is what GTM is, man. We have fun with these kids. And, you know, that's just what it is. They love us, you know what I'm saying? And then, like I said, once we, number three, once we get the kids in, it's family. It's family. They know, man, if it's a hurricane that hit Gainesville or it's a, you know, corona mm -hmm. or whatever, whatever, You, they know we got them. You yeah. know what I'm saying? Whatever we, we going to do as a program, as a team as whatever, you know what I'm saying? We're going to look out for these parents. We're going to look out for these kids. We're going to do everything in our power to just make sure that they're successful, not only in football, but just in life, man. And that's what youth football is all about, man. That's everywhere. Like, you, it's so much stuff going on and so much things these kids can be doing and all that. 
you know, we got to be teaching these kids life through football. Yeah. And that's what it's all about at the end of the day. Every kid not going to go to the NFL. Every kid not going to go D1. Every kid not going to do these things. But if you're teaching them hard work, dedication, you're teaching them character, you're teaching them how to be a man, you know, mm-hmm. all of these things that you can do at the, on the football just through the game. You know, yeah. it teaches them so much, man. Like, and that's what we do. And that's just everybody. That ain't just GTM. That's everybody that's doing this out here, you know, that's really saying that they for the kids, man. We just, everybody, every program throughout the world, sports period with the youth, man, you, you helping these kids grow up. You helping these yeah. kids, you know what I'm saying, develop into young men and young women. And being good citizens out here because they the future. They gonna be running the country. Yeah, most definitely. You know? and, <laughs> so and they gonna be running some of these football programs. Oh yeah, most definitely. <laughs> <laughs> so, you yeah. know, hey, hey, most definitely. Hey, hey, man. Um, you know, somebody had commented. I guess you guys have a uh, you know you got a big game coming up against maybe one or two of those uh, elite Gators team, man. Uh, you you want to go ahead and plug that while you're on, man. I mean, they trying to plug that. I ain't okay, know. okay, okay. Hey, hey, hey look, man. Hey, I, I just try to open the platform up. Uh, you know what I mean? Right, you right, know. Right, 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 right. <laughs> I focus on I see on the Cowboys, man. Like I said, at the okay. end of the day, you know, them same dudes, man. Like I said, at the end of the day, it's all love. Them, them are okay. dudes, you know, they cool dudes and stuff. But we beat them twenty-one to zero last year, coach. <laughs> What am, I, what am I talking about? Okay, 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 okay. You know what I'm saying? Like, what is it to talk about? We beat you 21 to scrape donuts. You couldn't score. You couldn't move the ball. You couldn't do anything, coach. Come on, man. Like I say, now we sat in that. That was with, that was with first year coaches, coach. Wow. That was first year coaches. That was their first time ever really doing that like that. You know what I'm saying? Okay. So now we got the same coaches. That's more developed on top of, you know what I'm saying, another head coach that been doing this. And then they got me. You okay. think you're going to score on me? <laughs> man, y'all crazy. Y'all crazy. <laughs> I got to man, listen. I seven you is the best seven you, period, man. Okay. I'm telling you. And it ain't even close. So, you know, like I said. It's all fun and dandy, you know, when you talking local football and stuff like that. But, okay. man, come on, <laughs> Come on. Yeah, we, I, we go. We want to play Hateville and RDU and New Orleans, you know, and stuff like that, man. You know, we run the city, man. They know that. Okay. Seven U Showtime, the best seven U, period. And they know that, man. But you know, like I said, they. Why would I? Why would I plug them? Why would I clout them? No, man. <laughs> no, nah, man. Like I said, Coach Seven U. Showtime is the best. Okay. That's it. Okay. You know, it ain't nothing. you know, they got these. They still eating these from last year. So, <laughs> so now, <laughs> so when, when that time comes, right now they probably sell. But when that time comes, get what? We just got to make it hot. Put the hot sign on. That's it. You know what I'm saying? You're going to bring another <laughs> batch. Yeah, yeah. Give them a new batch. You know what I'm saying? But, yeah, we ain't. We ain't nah, coach. We focus Osceola. Okay. You know, six U. Um, I mean seven U. We playing an eight U team. Okay. Okay. This weekend, um, my nine U playing a ten U team. My eleven U playing a twelve U team. You know what I'm yeah, saying? Yeah. And you know, all the other even ages in Florida elite, we playing Osceola, and that's what we focus on, man. We Dang. we ain't focus on nothing else, coach. Okay. Okay. We're gonna we'll step ahead. When that time comes, though, I call you. Ain't no pressure. Ain't no pressure.